it's me, the other one, and you are watching Super Wonder. Guys, today we are going to review our first ever smart watch or should I say smart dresser. So, before starting the review, let's have a look at its unboxing. Okay, so guys, before we open the box, let's have a look at its details that is mentioned on the back side of the box. Display size is 1.3 inches, 240x240 TFT screen days. Bluetooth version is 4.0. We have got a master chip of HS6620D. Now I don't know which processor it is. And charging interface is USB. Data save time it means your all exercises record will be saved for one month. Means you're running, you're skipping, uh, you're cycling, you're swimming, and all that stuff. Weight is 27 grams. Now I don't know that the 27 grams weight that, that is mentioned here is with straps or without straps. Battery capacity is 150 mAh Lee Polymer. Charging time is about 2 hours in which it, this guy will fully charge. Strap material is TPU. Dimensions are 86.7 by 125 by 30. And that was it in terms of specifications that I mentioned on the back side of the box. That's Unboxed this. So the unboxing experience is pretty, I guess, uh, minimalistic. Uh, here are the straps. Here's the user guide. And uh, let's see, are they in Japanese? I'm sorry, Chinese or English? Yes. Alhamdulillah, they are in English and Chinese. That's nice. Means we can understand them. <laughs> so that was it in terms of unboxing and, le and let's start the review. Okay, so guys, I have unboxed this guy. And before starting the review, we have to pair it to test it out. So here's how you can pair it. Okay, so guys. To pair the watch, you have to first download the Fit Pro app from the Play Store or iOS. Now, I don't know that this app is available on iOS or not because I am downloading the app from Play Store because I am using an Android mobile. So, Fit Pro, yes. So, I have downloaded it, this before. So that's why I will open it. You have to download it from here. So here's the app. And uh, you have to pay if you wanted to pay, <laughs> then you have to bind devices to experience small features. You have to connect this and while connecting, you have to turn on your location. So the location is on. Now you have to simply scan devices that are available to pair up. And I guess this is my one. And let's see what happens. Uh, yes. Uh, yes, it's mine. So here's how you can pair and I will tell you this apps, features and all that stuff a bit later in this. Ok so guys starting the review with the build and design of this watch. So if you question for me that how it is then my answer will be this. So not um, The build and design of this watch is like any typical lower budget range Chinese fitness tracker. I hope I call it right. Yes. So why it is? It's because its its design is a copy of Apple smartwatches, maybe third or maybe fifth, fourth, fifth copy. So because you have got a square dial this test material is TPU material like means rubber but its quality is so so means I don't like it but it is so so it but it is so 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 it 
its biggest design similarity is its dial icon. But its biggest design non similarity from Apple's watches is also the dial. Because if you have made notice or may used any Apple Watch, so you will know that every Apple Watch has a rounded dial or button on the middle of the right side of the dial or on the watch anything you can say so it's the biggest design non similarity of this otherwise the watch is same and now here the question comes that apple watch has a rounded dial to control it but if this watch don't have that then how we will use it here's the answer for that what has that then how we will use it here's the answer for that you will control it with the circular button button on the bottom of the dial if you press it once then it will show you the watch face hey 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 And the watch face will show you some details like time, day, steps for the day, your battery and on the top right corner it will show you the day and date, no, just date and on the top left corner it will show you battery and an infinity kind of icon which will show you that the watch is paired with a phone, Bluetooth, Bluetooth wise. So, watch face will show you these kind of details. But the problem is with watch faces of this guy is there's not any watch face. Because it means you have got just one watch face and it's the only one. Means you cannot change the watch face. And according to me, this should have give, gave you me or anyone who's bought this at least two watch faces number one the built-in one and number two the other one so the watch face held down side the build is okay mean six out of ten for me okay so guys the next point that we have on this watch is calorie monitor and step counter so in this watch, the watch will tell you that how much steps have you have taken so far in the day, and how steps have you have taken so far in the day, and how many calories you have burned so far in the day. And in the base of your steps, the watch will calculate how much distance you have traveled so far in the day in kilometers. So I found this mod pretty useful and good. I like this. Mod. Okay, so guys, the next part that we have on this watch is. BP monitoring mode. BP monitoring mode. You can say it. You can say it a uh, pulse detecting mode. You can say it a uh, heart rate scanning, scanning mode. Anything. So in this mode, the watch will detect or scan, should I say, your heart rate. So you have to press three times the circular button on the bottom of the screen. First time it will show you the watch face, second time it will show you your calories and step counter and for the third time it will show you the heartbeat scanning mode. So while you are in heartbeat mode you have to long press that circle button and it will start, it will start measuring your heartbeat. This is a nice thing and because this watch is a fitness tracker that's why you have got this feature. And I am not satisfied with its trading because you have got a just a little, little hearted BP um, monitoring sensor, and I don't know how accurate its result is. So I am good to see that this feature is, but I am. Um, worry or should I say sad at the same time because I don't know that how much accurate this feature is. So I am 50 50 in terms of this feature.
And also guys, I wanted to mention an additional or should I say special feature of this watch which is water resistance. Yes, my water. This watch is IP67 water and dust resistant and it can survive till the depth of 1.5 meter for 30 minutes of time. But I will not recommend you to wear it while doing every water activity because there is no warranty provided. I will not recommend you to wear it while doing every water activity because there is no warranty provided for this watch. So no water damage will be recovered. Your money will be wasted if this guy will be water damaged. So be careful on that. Okay so guys, the next mode that we have to cover in this watch which this guy has is the sports mode. In sports mode you can do some exercises like uh, running, walking, skipping, sit-ups and all that stuff. So you can do that. If you long press that circular button on the bottom of the dial then that exercise will be started. It will start in timer and in that timer it will be continuously monitoring your calories that how much your calories are burnt and all that stuff. So you can do that. If you long press that circular button on the bottom of the dial then that exercise will be started. It will start in timer and in that timer it will be continuously monitoring your calories that how much your calories are burnt and if you wanted to do home workout, easy home workout in your house while quarantine or this whole COVID-19 scenario. So this is the best thing if you wanted to do that. The next feature of this watch which is sedentary reminder and it's a feature of this watch and of every fitness factor because uh, sedentary reminder means is a reminder in which the watch will give you and remind that you have been sitting for too long please walk for a while or drink some water you need a blood circle you need a movement to do your blood circle next thing that we have to cover on this watch is settings now personally i knew that the settings will not be well descriptive and will not provide you that much amount of options that we have got in other smartwatches but its settings is lower than my expectations means my expectations are lower but its settings in re general general in reality is lower than my expectations very lower <laughs> means you have ju got just two options just two options in the settings Number one is power off or shutdown. Means my expectations are lower, but its settings in re general, general, in reality, is lower than my expectations. Very lower. Means you have ju got just two options. Just two options in the settings. Number one is power off or shutdown option, and number two is reset. Nothing else. No option for the brightness changing, and nothing. So, I was pretty disappointed on that, but while I was downloading the Fit Pro app, I was thinking that maybe, maybe, you can control the watch brightness from the Fit Pro app, its app support that it provides, but I was wrong. You cannot change the brightness whether from your watch settings and whether from the app. The brightness that you have got in, from inside the box is the only brightness means mm, I don't know the brightness of the screen is 100% um, 50% 75% 25% any percentage could be but there is no option to change the brightness which is a con to me and you can consider it a con I don't know oh, the best, the second last and last features of, the, of this watch are Sorry, I'm not wearing it. It is starting right now. Uh, to short video, video quickly, I have jarred the watch 50% and now it's completely dead. 
So the second last and last features of this watch are the remote to take photos and phone finder. So let's talk about phone finder after and let's talk about remote to take photos first. So in this feature the watch you have to the watch will quickly open the camera app on your phone and you have to long press that circular button on the bottom of the dial of the watch it will open your camera and then you can record pictures or photos and it's useful in those times when you can't just simply put your long, long password and then that moment will be gone which you wanted to take photo or video it will open your camera and then you can record pictures or photos and it's useful in those times when you can't just simply put your long, long password and then that moment will be gone which you wanted to take photo or video so it's a nice feature and let's talk about second feature which is second last feature which is phone finder so both of these features are only useful and only available when the voice is connected with your phone otherwise these, you, these features are useless so phone finder is a feature of this watch where and useful thought scenarios or th should I say thoughts times where you are looking for your phone and you can't find it but your watch is connected with your phone mm, so if you don't press the circular button on the bottom of the dial of the watch then it will your phone will start beeping so you can find your phone which is a useful feature but only available when your watch is connected ok so guys let's move to the last last topic of this video conclusion so I'll conclude everything conclude my conclusion too so the summary is of this watch that if you have just 1000 PKS budget just 1000 PKS budget to find a cheap Chinese smartwatch or smart presser then you can buy this one otherwise you can look for another one and if you have 3000 or budget higher than 3000 then Realme has launched their new Realme band Realme fitness band or Realme sports band I don't know its name right now but they have launched it and during its sale on some amount of bigger its price is 3000 PKS with official warranty for about I guess 6 months or 1 month but it comes with warranty so you can buy, check out that if you have range higher than 1000 PKS otherwise you can buy this Okay so guys that makes us to the end of the video. If you like it then please hit the like button, comment with your suggestions, I am waiting for them. Subscribe and turn the notifications on to watch latest updates from me. Let's continue the video till then Pakistan, Zindabad, Pakistan, Pindabad. Allah.